couple of times a year at least, uh, but um, my dentist reminds me when, I, when I'm uh, in need of a checkup, and then if I've got any problems at home, I get an appointment with him a week or two. I remember when I was younger, you see, like, these two, they they cross over slightly at the front. Uh. And when I was young, I used to have to wear a brace. But one dentist said I have to ha I had to have them taken out. And there's nothing wrong with them. I mean, my teeth are a bit discoloured, but there's nothing wrong with them. But they were really bad like that. And they said I would just knock them out and put, like, you know, two falses in. And I was like, no. And my mum said, no. So, change dentist. And said, no, just wear a brace. And that was when I was about nine or ten. And then a few years ago, we were doing an, an article on kind of nice smiles, and we went to like a fancy dentist in Selfridges. I don't know if it's there anymore. Uh, I won't mention any names. But it was one of these real cosmetic, uh, you know, kind of spending money on a Hollywood smile type things. And actually, if you were really insecure, you would end up walking out feeling that your teeth all need pulling out and you need completely new ones in. So he was telling me what was wrong, what he did doing, and I was looking at like thousands of pounds worth of work. But not only that, with the prodding around he did, he knocked one of my um, old, uh, one of my teeth, old fillings out from school. So I needed to go to my regular dentist and get that done. So, uh, you know, cosmetic dentistry good, but be very careful because it really, I didn't need to have all that work done. I didn't need it done, and it put an around in my mouth, just caused me more problems. But another thing I would say, because I'm HIV positive, and it's one of the questions they ask you on the forms is do you have any uh, long term health uh, uh, issues that might affect your healthcare? Now, I always think it's important to say to professionals, doctors, uh, consultants, dentists, if you have got a serious health condition. I know there's a lot of stigma around HIV, but as professionals, uh, it's, it's uh, confidential information, but I would argue that it's also important for them to know, because as well as looking after your teeth, they can see underlying problems.